theatrical tradition. And it is also tonight our inspiration. Like a ghost light, the light that we create tonight will represent our commitment to be a place of safety and inclusion, and it will symbolize safe harbor for our values and for any among us who find themselves targeted because of their race, class, religion, country of origin, immigration status, disability or ability, age, gender identity, sexual identity, or dissident actions in the coming years. Our light here tonight will symbolize not only hope, but a belief that through our collective action, change is possible. It feels somehow incredibly appropriate for a theater company that focuses on the classics to turn to Shakespeare to start us off. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming resident actor Peter Schuyler with a short reading from William Shakespeare's The Merchant of Venice. The quality of mercy is not strained. It droppeth as the gentle rain from heaven upon the place beneath. It is twice blessed. It blesseth him that gives and him that takes. Tis mightiest in the mightiest. It becomes the throned monarch better than his crown. His scepter shows the force of temporal power, the attribute to awe and majesty wherein doth sit the dread and fear of kings. But mercy is above this sceptered sway. It is enthroned in the hearts of kings. It is an attribute to God himself, and earthly power doth then show likest gods when mercy seasons justice. We do pray for mercy, and that same prayer doth teach us all to render the deeds of mercy. I'm always struck by the words of the bard, but tonight, listening to that speech from the Merchant of Venice, I'm also struck by the infinite meanings that can be found in poetry. When Shakespeare calls upon us to be merciful, he does not simply mean to forgive those that have done or will do us wrong. He calls upon us to show compassion to those who are different from us, to move through the world with grace and with charity, to forbear the expression of our anger or of our fear, to embrace our common humanity even in the face of aggression and to be steadfast in our protection of those who need our strength. 